Hey Mo from Hot Jet, I want to go over our Hot Jet 3 with the hydraulics for the hydraulic drive for the hose reels, which is really nice. The electrics are great, but the hydraulics kind of an upgrade. If you really want to go a long distance out, the hydraulic I'd recommend, or if you can use it a lot, go hydraulic. Okay, so that's really important. Nice feature, nice upgrade for 2018. I think we keep pushing the envelope for a little bit better product uh, as we go. And I, I think that's the difference with our company. You can see a lot of new products coming out. The other thing is we love hot water. I'll tell you, go jet with cold water, go jet with hot water. See how your hose comes out, what cleans the pipe better, right? I'm not here to argue whether or not you should do your dishes or wash your hands uh, with hot water, but try it with cold water and without soap. There's a reason why we have a soap, the total C, we'll call it a soap, and we have hot water and high pressure. That's how you break the film and emulsify and clean. And out of 2,000 of these running, somebody's got to show me where it doesn't do a steady melt off and really clean the pipe better. And it's more beneficial down the line rather than blowing off grease and big chunks that re Reclogs down the line. Hot water is really the solution. Cold water is really the problem. But if you want to run cold water, you can run this cold water, or you can run it hot water, or you can run it warm water. And you can set the thermostats to whatever temperature. And you can run a 300 foot of 3 8 hose hot with hot water. So you got 3 8 hose, and then you got a half inch, you can run up to 700 feet. I mean, these other guys are talking 500 feet. And this unit puts out a solid 18 at 4,000. Now, if you want to see the engineering graphic curves of how much horsepower, either diesel or gas, you need to run 18 gallon a minute at 4,000, call us. Because this industry's been running under 50 horsepower diesel when you need 50 to it, it almost 60 to 70 horsepower depending on the elevation you're at. How are they doing that? I'd like to ask them. But this unit's a solid ground pound at 18 at 4. It's the real thing. And you can run hot or cold. And generally speaking, <clears throat> I like that. I'm getting squeaky. Generally speaking, we're a lot better price. And it's built to run. I mean, how, how, do, you, you, know, how do you beat that? First look at the trailer. I mean, this is just the best trailer in the industry. Just is. That's all I gotta say. I look at these other trailers. I wouldn't tow them. We're out, we're out where you gotta drive long distances. If you're gonna drive your jobs, you want a good trailer, right? Okay. So that's our Hot Jet 2 unit. That's our Extreme Flow 2 unit. We combine together, we double the flow to a relief valve, just like two pump stations. Works awesome. You can run the heater on or the heater off. It's, this is an engineered product. It's not an afterthought. I see these other heater companies mounting a heater off to the side of their truck. I'm like, come on. That's, an, that's not an engineered product. That's an afterthought. This is engineered for hot or cold water. Full controls, 5,000 pound axles. We can do a 330 gallon tank or we can go 660 gallons, right? Full rear controls. Here's your hydraulics. You can go easy on, easy off. You can adjust your flow. Same thing with the big reel. That's 500. It's designed you can do 700. And they build these. It's got the nice guide side to side. I prefer a solid mounted hose reel with a hose guide. It just really works well. Same with this guy. Then you're not having to sway the whole lazy Susan. Look at those, look at all the wiring and all the electric plumbing. Gosh, this is simple. Keep it simple, right? Okay, to drive, fast fill, tank holder, toolboxes. These are nice, weatherproof, lockable. Full access, nice little hydraulic tank, filter system, fuel up. All all, ac all full access. A nice cover for the front. Uh, call us if you need details or a bid. Love to earn your business.
Thanks. <laughs>